Elementary, my dear Jigglypuff. Legendary has just announced Rob Letterman is the director for the live action Detective Pikachu movie. With me to talk about Letterman's destiny is a Joe Star. Hello! Hello. I'm, I'm doing an air uh, Sherlock pipe. <laughs> oh, fantastic. That's, that's what this is. Well, well, my dear, let's discuss why Letterman is a good choice for this. That's, so, okay, so Letterman has like a nice uh, career so far of like fun, like warm, family friendly movies, which is what I would assume a movie about a Pikachu in a detective hat <laughs> would be. Like, I don't <laughs> think that this is going to be a weird, gritty, like Nolan esque right. or like uh, The Fountain. Uh, take on Pikachu. So the guy that did Goosebumps and did like Gulliver's Travels and Captain Underpants. Sure. Uh, is, is, is kind of the guy for the job, I guess. Well, so he also, he wrote and he directed Shark's Tale and he did Monsters vs. Aliens. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of animation. Yeah. Do we think, they've already said this is going to be live action with a lot of elements of CGI, but how does somebody with his background handle those things? So I think, I mean, this is the guy that has now made a career of handling those things. You know, like whether they're, they're full CG or like Gulliver's Travel or, or, or uh, Goosebumps, which had a ton of, people interacting with CG elements. Sure. I mean, that movie was, might as well have been 50-50. Uh, you know, this is, this is the dude that can do it. He can bring some pocket monsters to life. Pocket monsters! Yeah! Okay, what about the writers? So the writers that we have on the staff, it's Alex Hirsch, who we know for creating Gravity Falls, mm -hmm. and Nicole Perlman, who is not credited, but who wrote the first draft of uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. So when you hear those names, what does that make you think we can expect from the script? Well, I think, uh, with especially with Alex Hirsch, Gravity Falls is such like a warm, optimistic, fun, just very cute show. Like, people love this show. It's worth watching. Check it out. Uh, uh, it needed a plug from me. But uh, so I, I think that gives you a lot of clues as to what the tone of a Detective Pikachu movie is going to be. It's going to be fun. It's going to be warm. I think it's going to be like a really strong all-ages movie. Okay, well, what about Nicole? Uh, Nicole Perlman, I'm assuming, just like a lot of... Um, great 70s and 80s rock. You know what? I actually just remembered she was credited with Guardians of the Galaxy. So we know that she's going to have the music. Right. We know that she's got lots of great quips. We don't know that she's as family friendly, but I feel like because Alex is so family friendly, they've got mm -hmm. it pretty much covered. Yeah. But are you excited for this? I mean, I think... This is such a weird, I mean, I'm not a Pokemon guy per se, but this is such like a weird crew of people. Like, I mean, with the director, who knows, maybe you get Jack Black as Ash in this, just based <laughs> on the fact that they've worked so many times before. And with the writer of Gravity Falls, I think it, it if nothing else, this will be a, an interesting, solid movie. Gravity Falls, Guardians of the Galaxy, and Goosebumps. What does that mean? We want those to know, are the three G's. Those are the three G's. We want to know what you guys think. Comment, tweet us at SJ News. Let us know if you're excited for this. And of course, you can always click here for more Screen Junkies news.